This video is going to be on how to get your Vivo Smart Watch to talk to the heart rate monitor strap, the band that comes with it or that you can buy. Now when you set up your watch originally, this is a, uh, the watch is a Bluetooth device and you set it up, remember you paired it to your cell phone so that your cell phone would be able to communicate with the watch. You have to do the same thing with the band, but instead of setting the watch to talk to the cell phone or the cell phone to talk to the uh, watch, you're not going to be setting your cell phone to talk to the band, you're setting the watch to talk to the band. So I'm going to show you what you need to do for that. Let's see, can I get the backlight on here? I don't know if I can. First thing you need to do is, see how it says antenna on here? I think you can see it says antenna that's Bluetooth, this talks to sends out a signal that talks to the watch and these are your battery terminals if the thing ever goes dead you remove these four screws and there should be some uh, batteries in there at least one or two so what you want to do is get your strap out and see how it says Garmin pointing up when that goes on your body it's pointing up and you see Garmin pointing up so you want to attach this unit, you want to snap it in to the band, and now that will be talking. You don't need to do that, but that's how you're going to be using this anyway. And then we're going to go over to the watch. You're going to go to the watch and we're going to press on the menu. It would be nice to be able to uh, get a menu. Okay, menu. Start sleep. No, we're not starting sleep. I'm pressing on the menu. Let's get out of this thing. Okay, we, we've got this thing over here and we're going to settings. It's the most important part that you're going to be doing with this. You're going to get to this screen. And you're going to scroll until you get to the section that says settings. And then you're going to press on settings. Now you've got watch face, you don't want watch face, so you're going to scroll. Sensors, you want sensors, so after you see sensors, you're going to press sensors. You don't want GPS, GPS is already working, it's talking to your cell phone. So you want to scroll over. It's doing a search. Just keep scrolling. Add new. We're going to add new. Search all. Searching for all nearby sensors and accessories. Try again. It didn't like that. Get this heart rate. Let's see if I can. Searching for sensors on heart rate. Doesn't seem to want to connect. Maybe it is connected. There's a message that pops up that says where HR monitor to connect, so I don't know why that would matter, but I'm going to put it on my body now and see if I get a reading. Okay, so it's already connected as uh, you saw over there. GPS was connected, heart rate was connected. Um, HR 2592, that is the heart rate sensor, but what you need to do to uh, start this whole thing in the first place, let me go click back over here. This is exactly what I was saying. You have to click on the menu. No notifications. Click on the menu. All right, come on. Let's click on the right thing over here for apps. Go over here to settings, watch face, sensors, and right now we can see that it's connected but if it wasn't connected what you would do once you clicked on sensors is you would just go further down to oh my god come on sensors and then you would go over to add new and when you clicked on that it would do the search it would find it and it would connect it so that is how you Get your Garmin Vivo Active Watch to talk to a sensor or the heart rate strap, the heart rate monitor. It should come as a default already connected, but if it doesn't, 
then this is what you need to do. If you like my videos, do a thumbs up or a subscribe or a like if you want to. You can, uh, if you want to leave a donation, ask me and I'll give you my PayPal info and you can uh, go from there. Feel free to link this to any other website if you want to. Hey, good luck with your exercise program.